the topic of this video is changing exponential statements into logarithmic statements and changing logarithmic statements into exponential statements. Let's look at an equation. a to the y power equals x. What's the exponent in that statement? y. Let's describe it. y is the exponent that goes on base a to make x. Notice this is an EGOB statement, e, g, o, b. So when we convert this word sentence into symbolic algebra, we say y is becomes y equals, the exponent that goes on base becomes EGOB, and the a and the x are the two values that go after EGOB. So we get y equals EGOB a x. But of course, EGOB is just log, so now we get the statement y equals log base a of x. In other words, we have a very important relationship. a to the y equals x is the same as the statement y equals log base a of x. Replacing the symbols with shapes gives us an important conversion tool. Every a is going to be replaced with a blue box. Every X is going to be replaced with a red circle. Every Y is going to be replaced with a green trapezoid. This is called the converter. And the shapes get names. The blue box is the base. Notice that those all start with the letter B. The blue box is the base. The red circle is the argument of the log. And the green trapezoid is the exponent. Now, let's talk about each of these things. The blue box is the base. This makes sense when we look at the right-hand side. It looks like a base. What we have to get used to is the idea that the value part of a log that is lowered is also a base. Next, the part over here on the right is an exponent. This makes sense. It's up in the air. But over here, this is also an exponent. And to remember why that makes sense, you just have to remember that a log is a missing exponent. And this pretty much says log equals exponent. And then finally, the name we give to the thing we're taking the log of is called the argument. So you just have to remember that the red circle is the argument. Knowing your vocabulary is extremely important. Make sure you practice all of these names because they will be used throughout this video series and you need to know what is represented by each one.